Hello, people of the internet. My name is Johnny. Welcome back to another video. If you can't tell by what we're talking about in this video and just my appearance in this video, I'm in a very chill mood. I'm feeling lazy today, and that's why I'm making this video. I know I said I was going to do Flumpties 2 on mobile, but the way I have to make my mobile videos take a long time to edit, and being honest here, I'm just feeling really lazy tonight. So I thought, you know, I don't want to just not make a video, I want to put something out. So I'm going to be showing off the core collection, the Frostbear uh, plushie, which I finally, finally got. I'm going to be showing off some more of the FNAF slime because I completed my collection. Um, I think they're down here now. And I also got some more uh, Security Breach Mystery Minis. As well as something else which isn't related to FNAF but looks amazing and I want to show it off. So to kick it off, I got four of the Security Breach Mystery Minis and we're just going to open them. As of right- oh, of course boys, the knife is back. Subscribe, smash the like button, you know what to do. Yeah, as of right now we should be getting the, um, the new Easter Funko products at this point. But as of the recording of this video, they're actually, they haven't announced them yet. So if they get announced during this recording, I'll take a second and I'll talk about them in case there's any extra uh, info on them. And then also tomorrow, Darko's, uh, Razbowski's, and 8 Ryan's U2's figures release. I'm excited about that. Again, this is just going to be a chill video. I'm feeling extremely lazy today. I don't know why. I'm just very tired. But again, I wanted to get some video out, so that's why I'm here right now. What is this? It seems like it's a Freddy. Yep, it's a Freddy. Now, I believe I have all of the Freddies except for maybe the black light. Honestly, I have almost all of the Security Breach Mystery Minis, so let's hope that it's the black light. Just a normal Freddy. Uh, hey man, uh, that's annoying. Yeah, I believe the only ones I'm missing are normal Glamrock Chica, Flocked Vanny, and then black light. Um, what's his face? Freddy. Okay, so I have the final three here. Let's have a look. Who is this? Is this Montgomery? It might be. No. Who is this? I think it's Chica, actually, which is good news. Please be normal, Chica. No, how? Damn it, I already have you. How have I not gotten normal, Chica? She's a one in six. It's like Black Light Freddy is understandable. It's a 1 in 24. I didn't guess this one. Oopsies. Uh, and Flocked Vanny's a 1 in 76. But how have I not gotten... I already have you! I mean, at the end of the day, it literally is a gamble. So, I mean, it's my own fault for continuing to do this. All right, who's this? Let's go! Let's go! Normal Chica. Awesome. So now I'm only missing two, Flocked Vanny and um, Black Light Freddy. Anyways, now I'm going to talk about the FNAF slimes. I got the two I was missing, Nightmare Chica and Nightmare Fredbear, I believe this is. I don't know why I did this. <laughs> it's really unnecessary. I was probably the only person who actually not only bought the FNAF slime, uh, bought all of them, as well as, like, actually make a dedicated video on them. So I really don't feel like busting out the slime itself, because then my hand's gonna be all sticky and all that stuff. But Chica slime is purple, uh, Fred Bears is, is neon lime green. So now that I have these two, that means I am officially the proud owner of all of the FNAF Blacklight slime. Alright, so now let's get to the bit we've all been waiting for, the one I've been waiting months for. If you've been following my adventure, my quest to try and find the Frost Bear plushie, you'll know that I've been searching for ever, dude. I've no joke gone to Walmart almost every other day to try and find this thing, and I went there today, and I found like 20. Are you kidding me? I've gone there for months now, and I haven't found one, and I go there today, and there's like 20 of them just waiting there for me. So I, I don't know if I should have gotten more, I only got two. I mean, I'll be honest. I don't think I'll need more than two. Maybe I should have gotten a few more, but whatever. I'm not gonna like, you know, try and hoard all the Frostbear plushies. I'm not gonna like, you know, jack up the prices and sell them on some website. I'm just gonna keep these for myself. But yeah, there was a lot, so I, I didn't want to take too many. You know, I want to let people, because these guys are tough to find. These guys are really hard to find. So I wanted to make sure that, you know, other people had chances to get them. I'm not gonna buy like 20 of them and spend like, I don't know. How much money? 200 bucks? But yeah, I finally got Frostbear. I feel like I don't really need to review him just because so many people have already done videos on this guy. So I'll make it quick. I actually really do like this plushie. He's one of my favorites. FNAF are frosted tag right there. Let's go, boys. Um, yeah, nice little... 
Mistle mistletoe? What am I? I think it is a mistletoe. I don't know. I'm tired. Um, and I like the little bow here. I like the um, the eyes, the nose, all that good stuff. I really do like this plushie. I'll put them in the background somewhere, but that does mean I am now the proud owner of again all of the exclusive uh, security breach plushies so far. I've got security puppet as you can see uh, right down here, and then I also have Phantom Balloon Boy and now. Frostbear. So I have all of the exclusives during the um, Security Breach wave. Now before we move on to the core collection, I want to show this off. It's not FNAF, uh, but it is still very cool. It's the Unis Honest Holographic poster. Dude, this thing is awesome. I'll put it in the other room, not in this room, because this is kind of dedicated to FNAF. But yeah, I just want to show it off because I think it looks amazing. I got it today. And for the final thing, let's talk about the core collection. I finally got the sucker. It took a little bit to get here, but honestly, I don't care. Um, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't really need this. I own all the FNAF games on Switch already, and you don't get any, like, bonus things when you buy it, so if you own all the games already, you really don't need this. But I just love having the idea of holding the FNAF games in my hands, that's why I bought Help Wanted, um, even though I already own it. I didn't own it on- I did not- I did- I didn't own it on Switch already, so I just bought this anyways. Uh, it worked out nicely, but I did already own all the FNAF games on Switch, so I didn't need this, but again, I like having it because it's FNAF physical. Really, um, I, I really wish there was something extra. Um, it would have been cool if there was a dedicated, like, application on the Nintendo Switch or whatever platform you have it on, where you can select what game you want to play, you can look at, like, some, I don't know, some extra things from behind the scenes of developing the games. I'm not, I don't know, I just wanted something a bit more. Even, like, the inside, it's weird because isn't that the FNAF 2 office from Help Wanted, even though Help Wanted is its own, like, copy? But yeah, the cartridge is very nice, right? You got Freddy on it, it's got FNAF. It has the makers. On the back, it's nothing too special. You got some screenshots of the game. You have renders of Funtime Freddy and Socus Baby. It's not gonna focus, but you have screenshots of the show stage of FNAF 2, the closet FNAF 4. And um, what camera is that? I can't see, um, but it's Springtrap in one of the cameras in FNAF 3 Fazbear Fright. Oh, there, there we go. It's focused. The Freddy model on the front isn't fan-made, it's just altered to uh, to be more updated with the brand new look of the franchise. I believe it has some, like, um, textures from Help Wanted, if I remember correctly. Um, I don't really like this box right here, I think it looks a bit out of place, a bit odd. But you do gotta get the point across that it has FNAF 1 through 4 plus uh, sister location. I personally would have liked it a bit better if it had like FNAF 1 Freddy, Withered Freddy, Springtrap, Nightmare Freddy, and like Funtime Freddy on the cover, but that is a lot of stuff to have on a cover. Also, FNAF 1 Freddy in the FNAF 2 office, kind of weird champ. But yeah, that's it. There's nothing, again, you don't get anything special when you uh, put in the cartridge or the disc. You, it just downloads all those five games onto your platform, so Nothing special, unfortunately. And that's kind of it for this video. Again, I felt really chill tonight. I'm sorry. I didn't put out one out of Flumpty's 2 Mobile, even though I said I would. I'm not going to play the core collection because it is just the uh, the five games on a different platform. And we've played those five games all the time. Maybe in like a live stream, I'll like play them. Probably on Twitch though. Follow me on Twitch. Yeah, I just felt chill tonight. I wanted to still get something out though, so... That's why you got this video, a chill video with Johnny Blocks. Funko still hasn't made a official announcement about the new uh, FNAF merch over on their socials, so I guess I'll just talk about that another time if we get extra info. So, thanks for watching, hope you all have a nice night, day, morning, whenever you're watching this, and I'll see you all on the flip side. Goodbye.